Three days ago, we reported on the delayed launch of the Crew Dragon spacecraft. The fault was not with the rocket, but with the ground equipment on the launch pad. A clogged filter on the drainage part of the circuit that supplies fluids for engine ignition was identified as the cause. The filter was replaced, and the circuit was flushed with nitrogen to ensure that the Crew-6 mission launch proceeded without impediments. At 5.34 Universal Time on March 2nd, the Falcon 9 rocket lifted off from the launch pad 39A in Florida. The Falcon 9's cargo was the four-time used Crew Dragon spacecraft, named Endeavour. The Crew-6 mission commander, American astronaut Stephen Bowen, was heading to orbit for the fourth time, but this time it was his first long-term mission. The pilot, American Warren Hoberg, and mission specialist Sultan al Nayadi of the United Arab Emirates and Andrei Fedeyev of Russia were flying into space for the first time. The crew will spend six months on the ISS. Dragon, SpaceX, we have a nominal orbit insertion. Great news there for SpaceX Dragon. The first stage of the Falcon 9 was used for the first time, which is unusual for SpaceX missions. Its landing site this time was the Just Read the Instructions Autonomous Drone Ship, which was positioned 550 kilometers from the launch site. Meanwhile, the second stage reached orbit and systems checks could begin. When a quick check revealed no problems, the spacecraft could detach from the second stage. Crew Dragon is expected to dock with the ISS in automatic mode just one day after the launch at 6.11 Universal Time on March 3rd. Thank you for watching today's episode of Space Flight News. We would also like to invite you to visit our Twitter profile for updates on new episodes and other spaceflight news. You can find a link in the video description.